Next one, treetop target. There it is, there's the treetop right there. As you can see, this is a par three. Um, so they're not expecting you to get birdie on this one unless you have a character with a really strong fade to be able to curve it back to the green. Um, otherwise, you're gonna have to take a character, I mean, if you've got a straight character like me, uh, you gotta uh, curve it with the uh, impact area at the bottom right corner there. And just get it through the ring and try and make power from wherever you land. Just as long as it's not in the water, it should be just fine. Uh, it's also preferable if you aren't in the bunker because of that the slope sometimes gets in the way of your shot onto the green. But if you get in the bunker, it's still not impossible to save power. Oh yeah, baby. And that's it. Woo! Go, Yoshi! You are the king of all golfers. Flowering arches. Oh, we're getting all fancy now. Okay, this one right here. Um, see, this is where you have to plan ahead on some of these holes. Like, you see, if you hit, if you hit your ball over there, you're going to have to aim towards the left side. And then you're going to have to aim back towards the green. You don't really want to zigzag all over the place. So, play your first shot somewhere over here, I recommend. Um, a f pretty far away from the rings if you can. Um, because you're going to want to try and curve the ball around the upcoming trees and get through the arches. Because you, you see, you have to aim like through here now. Now you want to curve the ball. Um, ooh. <laughs> uh, let's see, where does this, does this get me over the rings? I don't want to go over the rings. Um, I think this, this shot right here should be decent if I get it like over there through the rings. Yeah, I think that'll be just fine. Let's see what happens. Uh, if I make a mistake, I'll just restart, but I think this is going to put me on the fairway. Yep. So third shot on the green. Um, fourth shot in the hole, hopefully. <laughs> Let's just hope that uh, this shot goes well. I think it's going to go pretty well. And nope. Yeah, it's right on the upper flat tier of the green, so this shouldn't be much of a problem shot. Nice strong power to get through the break and into the hole. Um, that's the thing about putting, is if you hit with more power than normal, you'll uh, putt right through a lot of the break and lower the break's effect. So the speed is just as uh, important as the, um, the angle of the putt itself. Okay, Funky Pharaoh. It does not matter where your drive goes. Just as long as you get it through this ring. Yes, it is a nose ring on this pharaoh, yes. <laughs> um, if you don't get it through the ring, just restart. Yeah, you see that that first shot, that would technically be a very terrible drive. But next, pu um, <clears throat> next shot here, you just hit towards the hole like you were uh, if you were hitting your drive. This is about where your drive would normally go. And then you focus on saving power from here on the Shifting Sands first hole of the ring shot course. Um, this might actually be too much power. I hope it's not too much power because I'm using backspin. I think I got it under control. Yep. Okay, next shot. Gonna be my power. Alright, Yoshi, you are the winner. <laughs> Never get tired of that ballet Yoshi dance. Wait a second. Um, anyway, uh, Rocky Rebound, first shot, just play up here, up here is pretty good, the second shot, you have to get through that ring no matter what, um, they're, they're pretty much forcing you to hit over the green, just like this, if you can, try and get the ball to bounce off the rocks over there and back onto the green, but honestly, it's not gonna work, <laughs> I'm just gonna be honest with you right now, I don't think it's gonna work. See, you got to be really lucky to get it back on the green there. And the waste area, um, if I didn't tell you before, the waste area is like where rocks and all sorts of bad stuff lies that would pretty much tear up your club in real life. It would make it all scratch and stuff like that. Not a place where you want to hit your ball out of in real life. And there are courses that have that junk and stuff like that. I actually would never play a course like that uh, in real life because I love my golf club set. <laughs> Okay, first shot, if you if it's not blatantly obvious because of that pyramid over there, play it over here. Um, because the next shot, you have to get over the pyramid and on uh, through that ring, excuse me. And hopefully you'll avoid that dangerous vulture. Actually, I've never actually hit that vulture. Does anyone know what would happen if you hit that vulture over there? Um, would, would it like... Would the 
vulture make a sound or something like that? Um, I've tried hitting, like, bullet build before and I was successful, like, on the Bowser Badlands course. Um, but they didn't do anything. I think I went right through the, uh, through the bullet, if I wasn't mistaken. Um, uh, so I think all those, uh, objects that are flying around the course randomly, I don't think they really have any impact on the ball. You know, there's no, there's no, uh, timing-related issues with your golf shots in this game. Dunk. Well, besides the power meter, you know, the swing meter, so to speak. Next one! Columns on high. This is definitely Yoshi's hole here. <clears throat> you know how high Yoshi gets. Anyway, so you put your first shot, like, right over here, if you can. Uh, as, as tight as you possibly can get it through that ring on the left side. Because the next shot's going to have to go through a ring on the left. This, this hole has you zigzagging all around the course, which is which makes it a pretty tricky hole. Uh, but hey, this is getting harder. It's harder holes, harder difficulty. Yeah, see that next ring right there? Um, angle it so that your star goes like right under it, like somewhere like around there, and then and then aim for this ring here, and then hopefully it won't go the next, in front of that pillar there. I think that'll be just fine there. Um, the next shot has to go in that waste area, no matter what, unless you have some other way around it, but I would doubt it, because you have to get through this ring on the third shot. Um, and this is pretty much the only way I know how to get through this hole easily, um, without trying to chip the ball in. And shoot, this is not going to be an easy putt, I might have to restart this hole. Oh, come on Yoshi, we can do this! Alright, I don't have to restart the hole at all. Yeah, of course you're a happy dinosaur. Next one, ring in ruin. Look where this ring is located. No! As you can see, uh, over here is some out-of-bounds area. Um, but this over here is rocks. You can play on the rocks if you want to, but you'll most likely get right up against this wall here. Um, so what you want to do is like bounce it off the rock and try and get into the waste area there. So I'm going to hit it right about there, and use Super Topspin to bounce it up to the right waste area. Let's just see how things go. And dunk! See? And that's exactly what I wanted to happen. Um, the rough would obviously be a little better than the waste area, but it's unlikely that you'll get that far. You have to be, have a pretty lucky shot, because uh, I don't think you can play it much closer to the land than that uh, without hitting that uh, rocky wall there. And that's the hole. Woo! So far I haven't lost any hole yet. Oh god, I just jinx, jinxed myself. I forgot how, how hard this hole is right here. Um, like right here, you got this ring off to the side. This thingy right here. Can you see? Yeah, this thing. That's where the first ring is located. So your first shot has got to be like around... Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say here is a good idea to put it. No guarantee, because the, the next shot you have to land on top of the ruins, and that's not easy to do, because the ruins are, of course, made of rock, and rock is not something a ball likes to land on. <laughs> um, like, see, this shot's got to go around that one and through that one. Uh, maybe I'll... Can you hit onto the sand right here? Um, I don't want to find out if I can, honestly. Um, let's see here. Right there. Through that, I'm not going to be able to do this, am I, because of that wind. Dang it. Uh, let's try... Let's try hitting it short, and see how that goes. A little backspin to control it. It'll easily go through that ring. And... Third shot's going to have to go right... Oh, man. It's going to have to go through two rings at once. Oh, this is trick shot craziness here. Uh, I think I can manage this. I think this is going to be good. One, two, yes! And I think I'll be able to save power from that bunker. I think. Yes, I will. Alright, things are looking good. Let's just play a little further than uh, I would normally play it because of that tier over there. I want to get to the upper side of that tier to have an easier putt. Um, because all I have to do is save power here. And that should be it. 
Yes, no failures for the first three courses. Celebrations for the dinosaur druggies. 